March 3, 2022 is a Thursday. Welcome to your daily weather for Baltimore. Dress for cold. The temperature today should reach up to 50 degrees Fahrenheit and down to 32 degrees Fahrenheit. Humidity is at 33%. You can expect 1.22 millimeters of rain and no snow today. Some clouds. We've got moderate wind at about 14 miles per hour. Tomorrow is going to be cold with broken clouds. Saturday is going to be cold with overcast clouds. Sunday is going to be warm with light rain. Monday is going to be warm with light rain. Tuesday is going to be cold with heavy intensity rain. Wednesday is going to be cold with broken clouds. No weather alerts at the moment. And now for the news. Warning, some news stories can be disturbing or offensive. Stories are provided by various sources. In our next story, Marriott just opened its 8,000th hotel in a very special location for the brand. The largest hotel brand in the world just got a little bigger with the opening of Marriott's 8,000th hotel. Yes, you read. That right, 8,000 hotels. In other Maryland news, the 25 happiest cities in America. Happiness may be subjective, but that doesn't stop experts from trying to quantify it. We've shared reports ranking the the happiest countries in the world and the happiest states in America. In other Maryland news, Maryland officials outline package to tighten cybersecurity. Maryland lawmakers highlighted a package of measures Wednesday to tighten cybersecurity in the state. In other Maryland news, find COVID tests, vaccinations in Baltimore County, March 2. Baltimore County, MD As of Wednesday, Baltimore County reported a total positive COVID-19 case count of 130,584. In our next story, find COVID tests, vaccinations in Prince George's County, March 1st. Prince George's County, MD As of Tuesday, Prince George's County reported a total positive COVID-19 case count of 168,933. In other Maryland news, find COVID tests, get vaccinated in Howard County, March 1st. Howard County, MD As of Tuesday, Howard County officials reported a total positive COVID-19 case count of 43,022 so far. Wow, I have no opinion at all, but Biden's Fed nominees are frozen as one faces Republican questions. The White House continues to support Ms. Raskin. That's it Maryland. Have a good one. To help support improvement of our show, please click subscribe. See description for sources. This content contains information from OpenWeather, TM, API, which is made available here under the Open Database License, ODBL.